Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So back in November, I ordered quite a few things from Black River, and which now I've forgotten what I ordered. But just today, this arrived. Black River. So today, I'll be doing an unboxing of this Black River stuff. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm actually really excited right now because it may seem as a surprise, but you guys may have noticed I don't really have any Black River stuff. I have this Black River picnic table and, and that's it. But in here is around $200 worth of Black River stuff. So time to open it up and see what I got. And I'm even more excited because I ordered this already almost three months ago and I kind of forget what I actually ordered. <laughs> This is quite a bit of a mystery to me. Like, I cannot remember what I ordered. That may just be because I just order way too much stuff online and never actually buy something from a store. It's not my fault that I live 35 miles from like the nearest town to actually get something. And it's a town with 20,000 people in it. All right, time to see what I ordered straight from Germany. It is here. It's a piece of cardboard. Let's go, we got the new RAM. It's a piece of cardboard. <laughs> Yo, this piece of cardboard is actually pretty sick. Yo, Black River cardboard. Now I remember that I ordered this. Like, I'm actually really excited that I got this. This is like such premium quality cardboard. Like. Now that I already broke the first item, I think let's move on to the next one. What? There's paper in the box. Okay. Starting to feel some things. Yo, this is actually cool. Are these posters or something? Yo, no way, these are actually pretty cool. I actually didn't even know Black River had like posters. This is actually pretty cool. It's impossible to have these open. But boom, posters. I hope these are stickers because I want some stickers. But what are they though? <laughs> I'm actually confused. Are these just posters? Yo, Black River comic. I don't know, I think these are just kind of more poster type things. I'm pretty sure I had rubber bands like this when I was like really little, like back in like 2011 or something. But yeah, I have a vivid memory of these types of rubber bands. They're just like really thin, have these little like lines on them. I don't know, I do remember these. All right, we have something here. We also have something here. Yo, first, uh, wait, what are these? Ooh, there's actually some weight to that. Ooh, there we go. Wait, are these stickers? Yo, those are huge. And then just little like, trick list thing. Yo, these are sick. But what is in the bag? Yo, now I can kind of remember what I ordered. I got just like a little bit of a tune-up kit, I guess, like just some pivot cups, some bushings, a couple like washers. So pretty cool. I love how Black River just does like fingerboard pictures all over everything. Yo, more stickers, let's go. I'm still trying to track down the fingerboarding ruined my life because so far I now have two of these. Fingerboarding prohibited. There can't be more stickers. And there are a lot more stickers. <laughs> this is the same as one of those posters that I had. Oh, same with this. Boom, there you go. Okay, we will be completely honest. I kind of forget what this is, so that's why I want to open it up. It feels like some sort of ledge. But again, I kind of forget what I actually ordered. What will it be? Ooh. Okay. I forgot that I ordered this, but I'm actually really happy I did. I'm a little disappointed there's no like grip tape on the bottom so it doesn't slide around, but I can just put some on. Wow, this is actually a lot bigger than I thought it would be. I don't really know what I was expecting. Yo, I love these bricks. All 
right, one last thing here, and I'm pretty sure you guys might know what this is, and I also know what this is. We got coping on top, got a ramp in here, and something over here. So good. I will be honest, this seems bigger than I thought it would be, and this seems a little bit smaller than I thought it would be in comparison with that. It's still a decent size, but I did think it would be a little bit bigger. But man, I'm actually really happy about how good this is. Just the angles about everything, like it kind of goes like one angle and then it goes really steep. It just has such a nice feel to it. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that this is probably one of the best value things you can get off Black River. I don't know if all of you will agree with me, but you have a ledge here, got a quarter pipe and a spine, all in one ramp that's actually not too expensive. Now time to have some fun with these obstacles because I'm a little bit bored of this and now time to have some fun with these. I am honestly pretty happy with these. Right at first I was a little bit disappointed of how small this was, but now that I've been using it, it's actually pretty fun. I kind of like it actually because it kind of forces you to get good at like the little technical like jibs and stuff, which makes you a better fingerboarder altogether, so I'm actually pretty happy with it. And it is so smooth. <laughs> So Black River definitely never disappoints and I definitely need to put some wax on this brick because it does not want to slide that well. I still feel bad doing this with dynamics, like it just feels so wrong grinding your brand new trucks on brick. But I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing video and drop a like on this video for good luck. I now have three Black River products, let's go. Actually technically four now. I'll probably set these up in a different video because I have a new setup coming out and I really wanna show you guys setting it up in a video so stay tuned for when this comes out. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit the subscribe button right over there so you don't miss out on any brand new content coming out soon. Social media links are straight down there, not over there. One video over there, another one over there and I will see you in my next video.